lot of guys get up at 5.30 in the morning on Saturday to be on the golf course at uh, 6 a.m. tea time. This is not one of those occasions. It is Friday, January 28th, and uh, I'm set up and everything. I uh, just got a pre-flight. I'll be ready to go. Looks like I was going to try to do maybe a first flight to the point today, but it's looking like it may not be quite strong enough, so it may just be a just a ridge soaring day, maybe even a sled run. You never know. Uh, Dean Funk has funked out on us, so he's in Atlanta. Uh, I was thinking of waiting for Scott, but uh, I don't know where he is, so uh, may wait for him or may not. Don't know. Uh, might see if uh, things pick up a little bit and get a little you know, maybe a little more conducive to uh, staying up on the ridge. But uh, either way, one thing's for sure. It's going to be a awesome day. <laughs> okay. This is 1,900 feet above ground level, above the LZ, which is about... about 140 feet, but that's all right. It's about 400 feet over the ridge. That's Burkhalter Gap Road down there. We're now pointed away from the point. Don't think I'm going to try for the point today.
still have a little fun to do a wing over to. Well, stayed up about 40, 40 minutes or so. Could have stayed up longer. My neck and back was just getting tired. I really figured I needed to get down before I started getting cramps and stuff like that because that wigs me out. But it's pretty rowdy. Great flight. Great ridge soaring. The LZ was uh, pretty crappy coming in. But, uh, but it is all right. Beats the heck out of playing golf.